Okay, sorry the last one cut out. Let me go ahead and pick back up where we left off. So, let's see. Okay, 12 minus 3, 12, 11, 10, 9. Okay, 7 minus 1, 6. 693 is our answer. Okay, we did that in the standard algorithm. We did that in the place value chart. Did we get the same answer? We did. 693. So it's either way you like doing it. All right. 693 what? Milliliters. All right. We always put a label. Milliliters. Okie dokes. Once you have that, go down to the next quadrant. And let's try 360 minus 224 milliliters. Okay, now I'm going to do the same thing I did at the top. Hundreds, tens, ones. 10 ones, make a 10. 10 tens, make a 100. How many hundreds make a 1,000? 10, 10, we regroup at 10, okay? All right, let's go ahead and do this one first. So how many hundreds do we have? Three. How many tens do we have in the first number? Six. How many ones? None. All right. And we want to take away four zeros. Oh, we can't take away any though. So what do we have to do? We actually need to take this one away now over here, cross it out and break it down here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, we just moved this one over here because ten ones make a ten rod. Okay. Now we can take away four, right? We can take away four. One, two, three, four. Okay. Six tens take away two tens. Can we take away two tens here? Yes, we can. One, two. Okie dokes. Three, take away two. Can we take away two here? Yes, we can. One, two. All right, how many hundreds do we have left? One hundred. How many tens do we have left? One, two, three hundred. I mean, three tens or thirty. And how many ones? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. A hundred thirty-six milliliters. Let's go check our work. So 10 minus 4. Can you do it? Nope. Got to regroup. Make this a 10. Bring this down to 5. 10 minus 4. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Five. Oh, so far we're good, right? 6 and 6. 5 minus 2. 5 take away 2. 3 left. So far, we're doing good there. Three take away two. Three take away two. Oh, two. <laughs> Goodness is one. I had a hard time moving my fingers there. 136. 136 what though? Milliliters. 136 milliliters. We got the same answer, just in different ways. So my question is, do you like standard 
algorithm or do you like place value chart? Which one do you prefer to do? Okay, I like place value chart. I think it helps me understand why we regroup in the first place. Okay. All right, go ahead and go to the back page. And this one is your practice problem. I'm going to give you three practice problems. One, two, three. Problem one. 938 minus 440. Number two, 807 minus 732. Oh, and then this one was centimeters and this one was grams, okay? And number three will go 60 minus 24 milliliters. Okay, so um, if you were paying attention and you're watching this video, instead of doing today's problem set, you're gonna do these three problems on a whiteboard and you're gonna submit that instead of doing the four pages of the problem set. Okay, so you do these three problems on a whiteboard, either in standard algorithm or place value chart, okay, and upload that as a file for Thursday math. Don't do the, don't do the um, problem set, just upload your whiteboard with these three problems. All right, so you guys can log off now and... Um, if you need help with this, though, I can do it with you. So number one would be 938 minus 440. This is centimeters. Eight minus zero. Eight. Three minus four. Can't do. Got to regroup, right? 13 minus four. 13. 12, 11, 10, 9. 8 minus 4, well I know 4 is half of 8, so 2 of 4 is 8, so 4, 498 what? Centimeters, okay? If you prefer doing place value, hundreds, tens, ones, 900, 1, 2, 3, 4, Five, six, seven, eight, nine hundred, thirty, eight, okay, take away no ones, easy, take away four tens, can't do, what do we have to do? We have to borrow, we have to regroup, take away one of these, Put it over here. Ten tens make a hundred, right? So one of these becomes ten of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Now can we take away four? Yes, we can. One, two, three, four. Okay, we took away three, four. Took away our four. Now nine, take away four. Can we take away four here? 400, yes we can. One, two, three, four. How many is left all together? You figure it out, you tell me. All right, 400. How many? We have nine, because five and four is nine. And then three, six, seven, eight. 498, 498, we got the same amount, 498 centimeters. Okie dokes. Let's try number two. So number two was 807 minus 732. All right, the only thing I'm going to say um, is this one, you can easily do it, 7 minus 2. You're going to need a regroup on this one. And borrow from here. Okay, if you're doing place value, you 
you're going to have 8 here. none here and seven here. You're going to take away two, which you're going to easily do. You cannot take away three here because you don't have it. So I'm just going to tell you now, cross this out, put it over here. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Make it ten. Now you can take away the three. Now you can take away the seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, you can. Okay? Once you've taken away all these, taken away your seven, your three, and your two, tell me what the total is. All right, so if you were watching this video all the way to this point, remember that you're not doing the problem set. You're only answering these three questions on a whiteboard and submitting your picture of these three answers and, like, how you solved it to Thursday math. All right. Good job, guys. See ya.